unplugged tonight in Colorado Springs. Plans finally moving forward to complete the Powers Boulevard extension. There's enough funding now to complete the first phase of the project. The goal is to start construction this fall. News Highs Katie Blaze turns us live in the Northgate area with the latest. Katie. Well, funding has always been an issue as CDOT doesn't have the money to complete the project, but recently Colorado Springs City Council approved a shift of more of the sales tax general funds to go into an urban renewal account to help pay for the project faster. The extension of powers has been uh, uh, contemplated for decades, really. It's a critical piece of transportation for people in Colorado Springs, and major changes need to be made to it to keep cars and revenue flowing. It reaches Highway 83 now, at that point, then uh, travelers either have to go north and get to Northgate Road or south and get to uh, Interquest Parkway. Leaving properties like this one in Northgate undeveloped. Until that powers extension is built, it can't be developed because it doesn't have access, it doesn't have visibility. But with a recent amendment by the city council to how sales tax revenue is shared, things are about to change. Now that that's been approved and that, uh, that gave the Metropolitan District the bonding capacity uh, needed to complete phase one. Phase 1, Interstate 25 to Voyager. Phase 2, Voyager to Highway 83. The project, something people like Mitchell Roth have been waiting for. He's the co-founder of Bourbon Brothers Entertainment. For us, we spent a lot of time standing in our own parking lot looking down at where the intersection was supposed to take place and there was no dirt moving. Now that plans are moving forward. It's going to put a spotlight um, on the north end of Colorado Springs. As many of those cars as we can attract will take them. And I'm told the next step is to put the project up for bid. Some agreements still need to be made between the Metro District, the city and CDOT to be able to start construction. The goal for phase one to have it completed in about two years will keep you updated on funding for phase two. Always watching out for you, Colorado Springs. Katie Blaze, News 5.